Hello. So today lessons are we do the design the design and connect the DOL. DOL means a direct online strata. Direct online magnetic strata circuit which control the 450 volt three phase are SCI motor and incorporate time uh, clearly. So in this case, are the those are the equipment. Here strata, here are two motor, and here is a combia one, combia two hopper. And two phase are DOS strata is, is needed and the time over are and also one stop start station. And two for the time delivery and two the three phase are uh, three time in a 450 volt SCI motor, two kilowatt or similar multimeter. And also the three phase are lead and the three phase lead and the four millimeter sheet of banana plant connecting this. So this is a uh, circuit we have to do it. So in this case, uh, how this working is a uh, Two are four hundred fifty volt, two kilowatt, three phase square K energy motor on Kovia system are to be controlled by the magnetic conductors. And so the conductors and other control equipment are located at the metallic enclosure, which has a uh, single star stores uh, station located on the Kovia. Kovia 2 is to start as well as the start button press. So when there's a, you press the start button, Kovia 2 has to be working. And also the Kovia 1 is start automatically 10 seconds after. Kumbia 2 has started. After Kumbia 2 started, and then after 10 seconds, Kumbia 1 started. Kumbia 1 will be the starting. In this case, you have to provide a timer. And the both Kumbia are to continue to run and the idle stop battery press as an overload on the idle motor or gas. And, and this means that when the stop is press, the Kumbia motor must stop or the uh, overload happen. So the three phase supply need to be the more. Time the overload lay has, has to be utilized. Operating voting is a code that I do for the So this is a circuit code data. So this circuit code data and then we have to control the diagram. So this is the operation step. We have to control the circuit diagram. So this is for the push button. So, the, so this circuit is a, we have to control the, uh, we have to draw the circuit diagram and you have to also have to control the circuit. So this is for the uh, push button display. So Push button in the indicator light, so the three push button and indicator less are connection diagram. Also, then we have to the talking about the uh, interlock. Why is the interlock device? Why is the timer device? No, it's as you have to do it. So the, the control diagram here. So this is a real as a strata control with a timer. So this is the type of the die online uh, uh, strata control with a timer circuit. So these circuits are you have to utilize for the test of that's of uh, exercise. So here are DOS control and uh, timer circuit, timer connection. So this is a timer connection here. And DLS strata control. DOS strata control timer circuit. So are the circuit diagram. So then you can search the circuit diagram here, DOS data and the timer control circuit. No control circuit has to be utilized for the uh, DESA exercise. So this is for the DOS data control with timer circuit. You have to repart this one for the DESA circuit diagram. So this circuit, this circuit diagram, you have to control this one. You try this one. This is the DOS radar control with a massage diagram.
And then we also talk about the my line. Now online uh, strata reversing circuit here switch go controller limit one limit switch high and reversing. So die online strata with reversing circuit. So this die online strata with the reversing circuit that diagram. This is what the side via the connection diagram and die online strata with reversing circuit. So are the uh, forward reverse data circuit die online strata with reversing circuit diagram. So are the die online strata with reversing circuit like forward reverse uh, controller circuit, power circuit and the control circuit. So those circuit diagram have die online strata and then reverse direct online strata circuit. So this circuit diagram you do a far <coughs> for the this is a side. And then you have to answer the two question. And reversing your conductor circuit, this will mean the uh, conductor leave here, your chain means that step by step are moving. So when you like, press a job, model will step by step moving. So this is a uh, diagram. And then you have to find out the appropriate circuit. That's what I'm going to join circuit. So this is a direct online strata with the joint circuit diagram. Those are diagram have to utilize like joint circuit diagram. When you press a job, model will be more step by step. When you press a direct online strata, when you use all the job suite, model will continue running. So this is for the joint circuit diagram. Those circuit diagram have to find out on the, the, in the Google and you have to check it as a diagram. So this is a direct online strata with joint circuit diagram. And then you have to answer the two question. So this will be the press circuit. So this is the motor starter here, made the pressing circuit, tire online starter. So those circuits are connected to the tire online starter, the press machine. Press machine, so this is the design of the tire online starter and the press circuit. So this is the made the pressing circuit, tire online starter. This is a motor press control motor circuit. So this is the kind of the motor press control. Press machine controls a motor circuit. Those are circuit have to utilize for the, the power of this one. So this is the metal die and the die online strata, solenite circuit. Those circuit have to utilize. And you have to answer the question. So this is a braking strata. Braking system means that when the you a motor is stop and you have to press a brake and the motor will be stop immediately. So this is a mechanical brake system. Mechanical brake system is used as a when you motor is stop it, you uh motor need to be stopped as soon as possible so that the motor uh army motor shell need to be hold by the mechanical brake. So this is a mechanical brake system. Similarly, so we also utilize a dynamic braking. Dynamic braking means a dynamic braking there when the motor as soon as it stop and it's a, we supply the DC circuit. Because of this DC electricity applied to the motor here and then it will be the motor will stop immediately. So this is what a dynamic braking. Dynamic braking means that as soon as you stop the motor, then motor continue to run. At the time, so we apply the PC body to the motor winding, motor armature, then motor will be stopped. So then uh, you also use a timely braking circuit.
So this is the time of breaking the motor. The kind of the circuit that now uh, we utilize, we provide to the motor circuit. The time of breaking circuit, so that kind of the motor uh, starter. So in this case, uh, we apply the DC circuit to the motor. As soon as the uh, motor is uh, stopped, we provide the time of breaking. Time of breaking means uh, we apply the DC su supply to the motor circuit and the motor will be stopped immediately. So this is a time of breaking circuit. Plum, plum breaking circuit means a uh, uh, as soon as the motor is stop, press a stop, and uh, we apply the reverse voltage to the motor. The motor is in current flow to the motor, and the motor will be stop immediately. So this is a plugging circuit. So this is a plugging uh, breaking circuit diagram. So plugging circuit. Or the plug, or plug in means that as soon as when you press the motor stop button, motor can be run at the time that we apply the reverse direction and the current flow to the motor and then motor will stop immediately. So this is the plug in circuit diagram. Those circuit diagram have to be thrown and you have to do this exercise. So this is the time is a breaking circuit diagram. This is motor as a dynamic breaking circuit. When you press a motor, so this the motor we apply the DC voltage, and then this one root the, after this a, a motor shut is a control by the we send a motor shut control and then we store the motor. So this is for the dynamic breaking circuit diagram. And also the those are the plug-in diagrams. Plug breaking circuit diagram. So this is a plug breaking circuit diagram. Motor start stop here. So this is a sub control. This sub control is a as well as a motor stop it. That sub controls are we set the circuit to normal condition. So this is for the controller. It controls the controller the power conductor, the power conductor, and the plus relay. So when you uh, motor presses a stop button, then uh, that's a plug. Uh, Forward conductor is off and then reverse conductor will be on. So then we motor will stop immediately. As soon as the motor stop, motor stop is sent by the switch control switch. The switch control switch also the uh, off the plug relay. So this is the way is uh, energize the plug relay and then it will off the, the, the circuit. So this is the way uh, it will uh, off the, the whole supply. So this is what we the motor start. Control circuit diagram. So this means that when you press a stop start button, motor will run for one. And when you press a stop button, and then the valve conductor will close, and the motor body provides us the valve body provided to the motor. Then the motor shut is a stop it. Then the property will order the whole circuit. So this is the way the motor will. Okay, so this as so long as the motor shut will move it, this one this switch is open. As soon as the motor shut stop it, this switch will close. Then the, the then that plug relay will be off. This is the way we uh uh so we go to as soon as the motor is shut is uh, rotate, uh this one is a stay on. And then when as soon as the motor shut is closed, that one will off and then Probably we off. Probably we off. Then the whole supply will be just disconnected. So this is the way plugging system. So this plugging system and the robot are breaking the circuit diagram. So we connected in the this diagram. So this is for the plugging and the time breaking system. So this is a for the voltmeter reading circuit, connection of voltmeter and the signal switch to the motor. Connection of voltmeter and signal switch for the motor. And this is also the uh, neural the back method. This is the motor testing. How you when you test a motor, in this case we use a uh, ohmmeter and we test step by step. This is the way the for testing like that.
So sweet control in that same model. Sweet control in that same model, we use this equation. And we do one of the f divided by b. One of the f divided by b means a uh, f is a frequency, b is a four. So in this case, and the speed. This speed, in this case, we change the frequency, model speed can be changed. So this is the, we use a test equation to uh, change the model speed. Speed control by the number of four means that we have to change the number of four by controlling the, connecting the uh, motor on the motor side, the main domain, we control the uh, supply to the number of both control, so that the this way we can also change the motor speed. So this is the fish method, we control the motor speed. The another thing is a chain of frequency. Where do you provide the frequency change method? We do the frequency supply provided, then motor speed will be changed. So this equation will be the starting method, motor body, starting, starting current, Starting talk, number of step, current during starting, tie or low, comment. So this is for the tie online primary decision, start up, start data, start up, auto transfer, start up, second decision, start up. Those are the starting body current relationship. So then we also, if you are want to change the wave wave frequency control circuit, This is a variable frequency control circuit diagram. So this variable frequency control circuit is provided to the motor and the motor speed will be changed. So this is a variable frequency control circuit diagram. So this is a relationship between the uh, uh, characteristic of the software study method and they are low and the tall. So they are relationship. So this diagram is a variable uh, frequency control circuit diagram. That's so also a variable control circuit power circuit diagram. And this is for the three phase of home motor motor secondary season starting circuit diagram because of the when the motor is started in this case it draws the high current so the current need to be reduced so by this way uh, we use a secondary season starting method here we use a three phase motor auto transfer starter auto transfer starter means at the starting time motor is uh, provided with a low voltage and then uh, when the motor gets a full speed it will provide a full voltage so this is the uh, auto transfer starter circuit and speed control AD is actually motor. This is what a diagram of all the speed control radio speed drive diagram. Speed radio speed diagram the power power start stop and also speed control circuit. This is for the speed control of the various frequency drive diagram. So this is the primary resistance starting diagram that we provided here, primary resistance starter circuit. And there's a two steps of primary resistance starter circuit. So this is for the control circuit, this is for the uh, power circuit diagram, this is a control circuit diagram. And primary resistance circuit diagram here, and resistance starter circuit, control circuit diagram here. So also we also utilize the uh, computer control system. Huh? So power passing through the CPU, memory, output interface, input interface. So this is the processing unit. This is for the programmable logic controller, the processing unit uh, to control the motor operation. So it also the CPU is a uh, record the all the standard operating step. So that also we also utilize the memory, input interface and output interface. Also power supply also included. So this is for the input interface. Uh, relationship and this is output interface uh, feature and the other switching device operating body to our relationship here also that this is the typical uh, memory body memory unit so you have to read the uh, page 144 uh, to that study the those things so here will be there's a drive online data control circuit control circuit uh, connection diagram PSC control circuit diagram PSC control so step by step PSC control circuit diagram are given here so do also that we use a programming device. Also, we have to draw the letter diagram. Letter diagram start stop in the allow letter diagram for our letter diagram here. So this is a PSC control letter diagram. So this is a step by step that PSC control letter diagram are given here. So this is a PSC input also programming logic controller and output device. Input device step by step. Also the PSC is a switch. Step by step control the output. So this is a PSC control circuit diagram. In this case, uh, we also have to find the four fighting. 
we have to provide them, we have to set a steady a PH, PH diagram. Also, that we have to follow up the, all the step by step out. Right. Next up, man. Also, we have to check this out. Lee, also, Lee connection had to be, we have to find out. So this is the second. So, this is the, uh, those lessons are we provide for the, uh, model control circuit. Then we also talk about the AC system. And G1 to G7. 